We present mixing modalities of service catching and speech for interactive model retrieval in virtual reality. This project is the result of the joint collaboration between University College London and the Istituto Italiano di Tecnologia. In recent years, sketch interaction has inspired many studies, especially in combination with 3D environments. 3D sketching is a metaphor explored with the goal of testing combination with different interactions for rapid prototyping and also to verify the potentiality of novel 3D tracked devices. In addition, 3D sketching has been used in artistic context for object designing and navigation through databases. In our study, we first outlined that sketch-based search is insufficient to enable the effective navigation of databases with high variation of colors among object parts. To overcome the limitation of sketch-based retrieval, we implement a multimodal system that extends previous works on VR sketching applications. To demonstrate sketch-based inefficiencies, we design a new dataset of chairs built from ShapeNet by segmenting a subset of 45 chairs into four parts and coloring them from a selection of six colors. This results in 360 color permutations per chair for a total of 16,200 chairs. We leverage recent advances in immersive through this sketch model retrieval based on deep learning models and create a generic pipeline where 3D sketch and speech interactions are integrated and their feature descriptors can be interchanged seamlessly. The user is immersed in a virtual environment and interacts via both sketch and speech to search for a target object from our database. Our system reproduced the sketch interface from Junk et al. 2018 providing a multi-view retrieval system operated by a neural network. After sketching, the user can trigger the system to take snapshots of the sketch alone or the sketch plus a chosen chair selected from the panel of the query results. The iterative refinement, the user can navigate the database by depicting relevant geometries or color attributes of the object. Speech interaction involves a sequence of complex steps such as speech recognition, tokenization, text interpretation. We implemented our speech pipeline in a semi-automatic way where the experimenter operates the voice search via wizard of Oz metaphor by using the 2D desktop interface. The hybrid method design, which combines speech and sketch, requires a formal definition of queries to prevent inconsistencies between consecutive queries of different type. We determined that a well-formed query must complete three stages, input, processing, and selection. For the sketch interaction, the input is the set of snapshots, the CNN backend performs the process stage, and the final stage is the selection. For the voice interaction, the input termination triggers the experimenter in the loop that creates the descriptor. The selection stage is identical to the sketch query. We designed two user studies to evaluate our multimodal solution. The purpose of the first study was to determine the optimal number of words per query for the speech interaction. This parameter will be used in the second study that evaluates the differences between three forms of interaction, voice-based, sketch-based, hybrid between them. In the first user study, the participant was placed in a virtual room and was asked to find a chair from a digital collection by verbally describing the proposed chair in the English language. We measured the accuracy of search with different length of the queries and showed that 6-gram mode achieved the best results. In the second user study, the user was immersed in the same environment of the first experiment and was allowed to use one of the three modalities for searching target chairs, only voice search, only sketch search, both voice and sketch. We showed that adding voice to the sketch improved dramatically the search. We identify three primary query strategies that provide good results, with small differences or additional loops. The first occur when the user sketches to find a shape and speak to find the color. The second is sketching to find the shape and refine with voice interaction. Finally, the user selects the colors with the voice. The third starts with the speech to find the right shape and then sketch to draw details on the intermediate results and terminate with the color selected by voice. This study represents an approach to combine two different interactions by merging knowledge coming from a deep learning system and a human input. 
As future work, we aim to replace the tasks done by the experimenter with automatic processes, controlling possible error injection, and evaluating their impact on the speech interaction pipeline.